Hey, Brent. Hey, Max. Uh, we're both pretty cool guys. Uh, I work professionally as a character designer. And I'm a background designer. We worked at a lot of major studios. Mm -hmm. We actually met on Rick and Morty. Uh, I've worked at DreamWorks. Nickelodeon. We both worked at Disney. Cartoon studios. Network. Yeah. All, all the studios, really. And we want to start a channel to help you guys out there in YouTube land. Yeah, we get a lot of questions yeah. online. Like, how did you guys get your job? How do I improve my drawing? So what's going to happen is you guys are going to send us your art and we're going to redraw it. We're going to redraw art that you guys send us. Yeah, from the perspective of actual animation professionals. I'm, I think it's pretty cool. It'll be awesome. Guys. I wish I had that when I was a kid. Yeah. For our first episode, we're actually going to look at some of our old, terrible middle school art. Max. <laughs> hey. Hey, I'm Brent. I'm Max. And welcome, welcome to Bam, Bam Animation. Animation. Brent, I'm not a prop designer. I can't draw buildings. I can't draw perspective. But I do have a drawing from when I was 17 years old of me trying to do that. Can you help me out on it? I would love to, Max. Why don't we take a look? So what is this? When I was in high school, uh, I got my first ever commission. Someone, one of the parents at my school, asked me to draw John F. Kennedy as a frog being shot. That doesn't sound tasteless at all. Who is John F. Kennedy, Brent? Well, he was uh, a Democratic president in the 60s. Who was allegedly, allegedly assassinated. Well, he was assassinated. Oh, yeah, you're right. He was definitely assassinated. That, that, that part we know. His, oh. There's actually footage of it. His brain exploded all over the car. Mm. Um, not a bad drawing, but really wouldn't be industry standard, which is what we're trying to teach here. Let's make an establishing shot with this background because I really want to get a sense of the location. And right now, I don't think the original one does a good job of really showing you that this is Dealey Plaza. Yeah, uh, it is a real location. So it's important to use reference. I want to grab some photos from online and see what this place really looked like. And you can also go on Google Maps to find out this sort of stuff. So let's get started on that. I'm going to rough out the whole thing. There's a lot of infrastructure here that I didn't include, like these fire escapes and buildings and this advertising sign. Yeah, it's a lot of work, guys, but you got to draw all this stuff if you want your background to be really believable and real. So tell me, who do you think it was, Max? I would say that there are many possibilities for mm -hmm. who shot John F. Kennedy. Um, it it could have been the FBI. Mm -hmm. It could have been the CIA. The mob, Lee Harvey Oswald, was later assassinated by Jack Ruby. Cool, yeah. cool name, by the way. And he, Jack Ruby died in prison. We never know what he was thinking. Two men connected to the assassination died right after. I notice every tree is sort of a different shape that you're doing. Oh, yeah. I want to bury it up. You can't just have a bunch of repeating same trees. So I put a round one and some bushy ones and a tall one. And get a lot, I get a lot of information in here, too, because we want those nice grassy knolls in that, that big building. All those little things add to it. The devil is in the detail. So, Max, uh, who else do you think could have shot JFK? Was could have been it? Russia. Mm -hmm. Or Cuba. Or Cuba. Uh, or the vice president who took over. Mm -hmm. You know, he called for a press conference immediately after and got sworn in. It seemed kind of like jumping the gun on that a little bit. I mean, you look for the person who benefits. Mm -hmm. That's all I can say. He escalated the war. Uh, could have been Jackie because uh, the president was sleeping with Marilyn Monroe. Wow. <gasps> Dude, I think that's a little too far. I mean, we're talking about the woman who tried to pick up pieces of her husband's brain. I didn't mention that Jackie Kennedy is a lizard and was very hungry and needed the sustenance of human meat. That's, that's interesting, but I would say from looking at the ballistics reports, I, I think all the signs point to Yoko Ono. By the way, Brent draws this fast. Yes, I draw a thousand percent faster than you can. This is not sped up. Well, that's why I work in the industry. Let's add some value, just so we can see some of the lighting. Wow, that makes it pop. Damn. damn. God damn. So I've got a drawing, Max. It's uh, from when I was 15. It's uh, a drawing of my World of Warcraft character, and I was trying to be a character designer. Wow. You think you could take a look at it for me? I would love to. All right, let's jump right into that. Your drawing, uh, just let me say, bravo. Thank you. For being the worst drawing I've ever seen. My favorite thing about it is that I didn't even draw hands. I just drew balls. I'm just joking. It's really good for a 15-year-old. I'll yeah. tell you that. 
but um, we're going to sort of make it more industry industry standard. Oh, you're going to make it maybe something that was animatable. Something animatable, something that people can draw over and over and sells the idea of a paladin. Ooh, I like that. That's, mm. This is going to be fun. Well, let's see what you do. I want to make her a little bit more girly. Mm. I think uh, you can't really tell from your drawing particularly that it's a girl. So we're going to get some anatomy in her that is feminine. So this design here is kind of like a nun. Mm. I love the cross dude. Yeah, I mean, you had that on your design, so I wanted to keep that there. This is a more angelic version. I, yeah, she's really beautiful. Her weapon is a little bit thinner. Her cape is more flowy. This one's kind of like a knight. Yeah, and I like how the torso is just a circle. It's easy to animate. Mm. Oh, animation is so key. I mean, you got to make those simple shapes. Yeah, yeah all, all characters have to have simple shapes because you have to draw them 500 times a second. Yeah, 500 times a second for those HD TVs. So this is kind of a good thing to show your art director. It's tight, but not too tight. Mm -hmm. It's there. And so they can get ideas, pretty, pretty clear ideas about which of the characters they can pick. If your 15-year-old self was an art director, which one would he pick, Brent? Well, he would be super excited that he had a name come, and then he would probably pick the one in the middle. Cleanup is a tough thing to do. It's kind of an art form within itself where uh, as you are cleaning, you sort of lose that original sketch, but you also get to improve it at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, My drawings always get worse when I clean up. Is that a thing? That's a thing for a lot of people. You, you guys should work at home and try cleaning up your own drawings. It'll uh, teach you a lot. And everyone in the industry cleans up their drawings. That's all you see on screen is cleaned up drawings. Oh, yeah. Oh, a paladin, that's sort of like a religious knight, oh, right? Yeah. It's yeah. like a it's like a warrior who loves God. Yeah, in World of Warcraft, it's like a it's like a warrior but with a blue bar. Shut the fuck up. Oh, level sixty, epic, fifty eight DPS. <laughs> oh my God, you're gonna one shot some noobs in a rappy basin. <laughs> How do I attack the flag here? You're like, oh, 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 and then bam, it's gonna proc Crusader all over them. All right. Okay. <laughs> I love your drawing, dude. It looks so cool. It looks like it could really be on TV. Dang. I never played World of Warcraft. I wouldn't advise it. What, what if the kids wanted the same treatment for their drawing? Well, I think they should send us their art to bam.redrawmyart at gmail.com. Bam. bam! What does bam mean? Well, I think it means Brent and Max, but it's also an onomatopoeia. If you guys don't know what that is, it's a word which expresses a sound. Yes. Bam.redrawmyart at gmail.com. Bam. What are their kind of onomatopoeias? Croak. Cacaw. Splat. Splart. <laughs> Bam.redrawmyart at gmail.com. Send it in, guys, and we're going to feature you on the show. We're going to feature your art and draw over it and make it industry standard. Yeah, and we might even learn something. I mean, I'm looking forward to this. Oh, this is gonna be great. Yeah, I, 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 I'm really, I'm really excited. I cannot wait to see the art that we get in.